first area we're going to talk about cleaning is the rotisserie burner in the back, our infrared rotisserie burner. You do want to always make sure that you remove the warming shelf when you're working with the rotisserie burner or firing it up. If you don't remove it, the intense heat from here can warp your warming shelf. So make sure you take that out. When you get to this area, we find that in barbecuing traditionally, people will do a lot more grilling than rotisserie cooking. And with that in mind, if you don't use a rotisserie burner, for let's say a period of two weeks or a month, which is not uncommon, it has a chance of building up grease and so on from the cooking that you're doing on the grilling surface. So what we want you to do at least once a month is to fire up your rear burner, which is your outside knob on the right, and you will strike this igniter here, it will fire up the burner and burn that off for about 10 to 15 minutes at least once a month. What that helps to do is burn away any of the surface buildup that's accumulated and then it allows the gas to flow freely so that when you decide to use the rotisserie burner for cooking, it's there available at its full intense heat when you need it.